Swiffer. The better pusher upper. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Rob. Hi, I'm Sherry. And this is our cat, Lily. This is Cinder. We've got the truck. We've got the trailer. And we're ready for our RV travel quest. Hello, RV travel buddies. This is Rob. This is Sherry. <laughs> and we got Cinder. The whole family's back together. We're back from Arizona. And we have just a few days before we travel full time. So we're working out some other little details. We found that we're having a little trouble with our molding. Uh, coming loose so we're going to do a trip to Harbor Freight to pick up a little staple gun or an appropriate little tool that allows us to put molding on and we want it for preventative purposes too because if molding comes loose on anything else we can fix it so the other thing we're going to do is um, get an air filter for the RV to help keep dust and uh, dog fur and just lint um, to a minimum and so we're going to do that at uh, Bed and Bath. Bed, Bath and Beyond. Yeah. And then today is New Year's Day. So, Eve. Uh, or Eve. Yeah. So we're going to go to a place that we like to go for that. And we also will be, um, oh, doing some pictures with the uh, 360 camera if we get a chance. So that'll be a separate video. So keep your eyes out for that. But we thought we'd try this particular 360 with uh, um, something with a view and, and what we're trying to do with that right now is give you guys a chance to see 360 video realize you have to adjust your viewer to high definition 720 and lessons learned and I, I hear that people with iPads are really enjoy it because they can just tilt their screen so so far it's been very successful and uh, we've learned a few new techniques of editing it but still got a lot to learn. So we're getting there, but uh, that 360 camera is pretty cool. So you guys are all ready to roll today? Yep. All right, we're on our ways. Talk to you later. Hi guys. Well, we've been doing some shopping, got some nails for the molding and got lunch. And we're going to, well, we're at the marina here at Everett and we're going to experiment with the 360 camera to show you Oh, just some something pretty that you can uh, scroll around and look around so um, it won't be in this video it'll be a video I launch at the same time so be looking for a 360 video that just kind of shows uh, uh, sh showing the outdoors and driving down the road so here we go so here's something I don't usually do record when I'm recording some of you guys are wondering what our 360 camera looks like and it's running right now so this is me recording the recording. It's a very simple camera, but it does a great job at 360. So anyway, that's what we've been doing today. Uh, we got some things to fix in the uh, RV. We got a new filter system I thought we'd show you. So I'll get you out of the sun. We'll uh, wrap this up and get going. Hi guys, this is Rob. I thought I'd show you a little project we're working on. It's kind of funny. So basically, in our Montana, on the roof, and I'll turn it upward, you can see over here we got strips that go across. And we're noticing that they're starting to come off. So we decided to try wood glue first, and we need, needed something to hold it up. So I thought I'd show you what we did. It's kind of funny. So this was our design to try to hold that up. So you can see here. <laughs> is we got a mop all the way up to the roof that holds let me get the glare out of the way here that holds the strip in place while the glue is drying however we're not we're still seeing a little bit of a gap as you can see in there so we got some small nails to use on this to cinch those down we found out they didn't use nails in that so anyway thought you get a kick out how we mounted that. It's kind of uh, balanced right here <laughs> on top of here which is on top of that but it's working so we'll show you the fix here when we're done. Okay another thing we were concerned with was uh, our air quality a little bit. We noticed this morning 
uh, there was sun coming through the window and there was a lot of air particles, dust particles, floating in the air. Uh, and we thought that with us traveling and stuff, it's always going to be stirring things up. So we thought we might try to do better and get ourselves an air purifier to help filter the air a little bit. So we went over to Bed Bath & Beyond and we got this Air Master and it's supposed to be help with uh, dander and pollen and pet stuff and since we have a full-size dog and a cat in here we thought it'd be a good idea. Yeah, most people don't even get to see our kitties and she's terrorizing us. So. <laughs> I know. With our fix we have here. So, uh, how much is is a Air Master like this cost? Uh, at Bed and Bath we got it? Yeah, we got this one at Bed Bath and & Beyond and it was $179. So it is a little expensive. And we also picked up some re, um, filters, replacement filters. And... This was, the filters were $36, $34, $35 for two filters, but the filters are supposed to last uh, six months. So this is uh, what we ended up doing. There's a strip across here. The reason they're not using nails is there's metal behind it. So what we ended up doing, here's a close up, is we put some little nails in and bent them so it put pressure against the ceiling as we put wood glue behind them. And it goes all the way down. Each one's got some little nails just to hold it strip in. And yes, you should use your casino camping book to hold the end down. Works great against the slide. So in three days we'll take that off. And we can probably pull the nails, touch it up with a little paint, and we should be okay. And it goes all the way across there. That's our fix. So today we've been busy doing all kinds of fixes. I want to thank you guys for uh, watching. Just a short little video. Once again, we're just getting things ready between now and next week to get ready to roll. We did pick up a lot of little things that we needed. Um, different kind of cookware and things we picked up today. And so, anyway, lots of things going on. This is New Year's Eve. So I wanted to take the time to wish everybody a good 2016. And we'll see you guys on the road soon. Bye now. Ready? Swiffer. The better pusher upper. <laughs> Try again. What am I supposed to do? You say the better pusher upper. Okay, ready? Swiffer. The better pusher upper. Hey. <laughs>